in my personal opinion, I didn't go with it into the public eye. It was Smiling Skeptic, and Miss Perfection, and the rest of the people that mirrored the video that let everybody know about Eli's rape. I mean, surely I can admit, maybe I shouldn't have questioned her rape in the comments section. It's kind of immature of me. But if they didn't want this to go into the public eye, they would have deleted the comment. Not made fucking several videos and asked people to fucking mirror the video about her supposedly being raped, in which I still don't believe in. The way that I think of it, if you're doing something to try and embarrass me, to try and make me uncomfortable, to try and make my life miserable, you're trying to tell people stuff that I don't want anyone to know. It is not so important for me to be comfortable that I just let whoever go and do something horrible to somebody else. Now, I particularly live by this when I know I wasn't the first one, when I know that if someone else had opened their fucking mouth, I wouldn't be going through whatever. When I know I'm not the first one, and I'm probably not going to be the last one if I keep my mouth shut, you bet your fucking ass I am going to tell everyone what was done. That might sound weird to you, because you're a selfish little bastard. That might just be completely inconceivable to you. And you know exactly who the fuck I'm talking to. But trust me, I'm not the only person like that. I'm not the only person I know who like, who's like that. So if something bad's done to you and you're going to keep it quiet to try and keep yourself nice and comfortable and let the next person that comes along just you know, get whatever, that's fine. That makes you a selfish, cowardly, little bitch. And that's not me. So I'm sorry that it's confusing to you, but there's your answer. Fuck off.